They fire out of there at the sound of the Turtleford Hotel horn. There's a good turn by all three wagon drivers, and they're going to hit the trail this way. Three across the racetrack. Shane Carter has the rail in the middle of the racetrack as a James Gang, and Jamie Labacane and three wide is Vera Nolan, and this is the way they shoot into the back stretch right here. Shane Nolan, Carter's neck, Yoke Bunch, and Minburn Angus on the rail. Running in the middle of the racetrack is a James Gang, and Jamie Labacane, and then uh, stretch three wide is Bob Jack, Sheet Metal, and Vera Nolan as they head on down the backstretch. Carter's neck yoke bunch and Minburn Angus is out in front. He is on the move. It is Shane Carter with the lead. A full wagon length in front of Jamie Labacane and the James Gang, who's got to be starting to fire right now. The Rapidview Rocket is running third. Bob Jack Sheet Metal, who has dropped off the pace. Here they come to the Warrington Seed Farms finish line. Here comes Shane Carter and Carter's Neck Yoke Bunch and Minbert Angus. James Labacane is trying to make a move, but they're not going to catch Shane Carter tonight. A wire to wire finish. The James Gang fires in to be second. Bob Jack Sheet Metal rolls in to be third. And a nice driven heat number nine brought to you by Tadra and the Main Street Market. Thank you to new owner Robin Brown. And they always talk about if you have barrel number one, doesn't matter what track it is, you have to take advantage of it. And Shane Carter coming off barrel number one does take advantage of that.